बहुत हो गया आई कॉन्ट शॉप एनी मोर अभी तो टीवी बाकी है भीड़ देखिए मार्केट में आई बाय फ्रॉम फ्लिपकार्ट डॉट कॉम ऑनलाइन या और फिर हमें सबसे ज्यादा डिस्काउंट भी मिलेगा आई कैन बाय यू गिफ्ट विद मनी सेव क्या ला दोगे मुझे डॉल हाउस बेस्ट प्राइजेज ऑन ऑल प्रोडक्ट फ्लिपकार्ट डॉट कॉम बी ऑनलाइन मेगा स्टोर वाई फाई मिला तो निचोड़ लेगा क्या ऑफकोर्स ऑनलाइन शॉपिंग वॉट यूर ऑर्डरिंग नाउ एम पी थ्री प्लेयर और कुछ फॉल्टी निकला तो फ्लिपकार्ट डॉट कॉम पे नो चांस और अगर हुआ भी तो रिप्लेस कर देंगे रिप्लेस हम वॉट्स गोइंग टू बी अ फर्स्ट सॉन्ग रिंगा रिंगा रोजेज डेट्स अ क्लासिक थर्टी डे रिप्लेसमेंट गारंटी ऑन ऑल प्रोडक्ट फ्लिपकार्ट डॉट कॉम दी ऑनलाइन मेगा स्टोर there's one way of looking at it and uh, we at ebay for example uh, every year we put out what we call the ebay india census which is uh, possibly the most comprehensive statistics on what india actually buys and sells uh in our report in december last year there were actually 3300 cities towns villages in india which actually participated in e-commerce in some fan some manner or fashion and that kind of grew by a third over the previous year uh if i look at it 3300 is a pretty good number and of that 3300 about i think 1100 were actually villages or rural areas as classified by the census of india if i take that statistic and that's been growing over a period of time i'd say yes e-commerce is definitely showing signs of being so so there are two parts one is internet usage right which is you know where like sounds like where 2003 china and the second is gdp per capita which is how much money people have in their pockets and that actually unfortunately is even behind right we are like 15 years behind china in terms of where gdp per capita is today india has a long way to go before it reaches there primarily because of poor internet penetration and low internet usage According to BCG, last year the average Indian internet user spent about half an hour a day compared to 2.3 hours in the US and 2.7 hours in China. The absence of a full-blown portfolio of products and services is one of the reasons why it's a decade old but India's e-commerce industry is still struggling to take off. What's going wrong? Is an exception. Analysts say that just 10% of India's 15 million odd internet users transact online. According to online market research company Juxt Consult, last year India had 9 million online shoppers who search but don't buy, and just 3.5 million buyers, which means that the lure of good deals could be irresistible. But some things holding the Indian customer back. E-commerce platforms like eBay are working round the clock to figure that out. The attention from consumers is mostly on branded products. They prefer to make their transactions using the fixed price method, which is they want to see the price upfront and they will buy it at that particular price, as opposed to perhaps auctions, which is you know uh, big in other parts of the world. Uh, and they expect a great retail-like experience when.
we're getting ready now for our busiest Christmas ever. Uh, we're taking delivery from literally thousands of vendors, literally hundreds of thousands of items a day, millions a week, being processed through our receive area. Once the order's packed, it's put on the conveyor, and the conveyors take it away uh, to the dispatch area. Every order is unique and individual. They come down the conveyor here, they go onto this magic system over here where the system knows exactly the destination. The system tilts, they go down, put into your carriers. The carriers take them away for delivery to customers all over the world, right from these docks here.